Carol, I'm filming the house for you so you can see it. Here we're in the front yard. And it looks like there used to be a driveway over here, but they fenced it in. There's Gally and Rebecca, because there's a garage back there. And so it's actually an oversized lot. And so there's huge garden space on the side and in the back. Um, this house was originally built for the principal of the Kennedy School, which is now, you know, one of the McMinimans. It's got a huge front porch. Half of it is covered. And the other half has this open lattice work. It's a gorgeous front porch. Uh, leaded glass door. Walk in through the door. And you're in uh, the living room area with a wood-burning fireplace, some bookcases on the side. And then over here is the dining room, a uh, built-in bench, and it actually has storage inside of the bench. Through the dining room is the kitchen. Kitchen has been updated. Um, kitchen's a little hard to film because it's at different angles, but it's got updated cabinets that have some pullouts, a gas uh, range. This door goes to a little landing area and then the uh, side yard. Um, here is the countertop with the sink and glass front cabinets. Uh, off of the kitchen area are two bedrooms. Um, they're talking about this bedroom maybe being the baby's bedroom. Uh, it's about, oh, I'd say 12 feet by 11 feet. Um, and then next to it is another bedroom, which is not the best paint job. Um, but it is probably about 12 feet by 12 feet. Uh, the view of the neighbor's house is nice. The neighbor has a nice little garden area. And then this window goes out onto the back part of the, um, of the yard. Um, and then right across from the bedrooms is a pretty good size uh, bathroom with the original tile wainscoting around the outside, subway tile in the shower, a pedestal sink, um, nice light fixtures. So next I am going to bring you upstairs. So I'm going back through the kitchen. Um, next to the door that goes outside is another door that goes upstairs. A carpeted stairway. There is a little landing area at the top of the stairs with a closet, good sized closet. To the left is a room that they are talking about they would use as a, a guest room. New windows up here, it's got a newer roof. Um, it's pretty warm here today, but it actually feels pretty comfortable up here. A bathroom with a shower, um, smaller sink with a vanity, fish tiles in the shower. And then here is another room that they're talking about as Rebecca's sewing room that um, also has a closet as well. And this has, it looks like they actually kind of, um, it, it's, I don't think it's fur floor, I think it's kind of the planks and they um, varnish them, but they look pretty good. So heading back down the stairs. through the kitchen and I will bring you into the basement. Um, here's some of the like the pullouts and stuff so uh, small appliances and food and stuff could go in there. Um, so off of the hallway of the uh, bedrooms on the main is the door down to the basement. Uh, again, carpeted, stairs going down. The basement was just finished by the last owner, so it has um, new windows, uh, it has insulation. Um, there is a half bath down here that is purple. Um, this is concrete floor, but they've put down uh, a rug in this main bonus room area that they're talking about could be a playroom and like where Galley could do her bike riding and stuff during the winter. And then there's this little raised area, which I think was built um, over the um, pony foundation wall. And talking about what a fun little kids area this would be as the little gets a little bit bigger. Um, and then more storage over here. 
And then on the other side of the stairway is where the utility room is. Um, furnace, water heater, uh, room for side-by-side -side washer dryer, new electric panel, and then there's space on the other side for them to put some shelving units and stuff. There's a um, doorway to go outside from down here as well. So I will bring you out and show you the backyard. And so here is the backyard, backyard. Say hi again. There's the girls and the baby. And then here is the side yard area. And like I said, a detached garage. There's new fence all the way around it. There's an alley behind it that we drove through and there is a gate so you could get uh, parking back there if someone wanted to. There we go.